The following is intended for ages 13 years and up. Viewer and parental discretion is advised. Thank you. Shabam! Studios. Hey YouTube, welcome to another video by Shablam Studios. And today, Beast Morphers 6 inch basic figures are here. So far that I have, wave one consisted of the core three rangers, red, yellow, and blue, the cyber villain, blaze ranger, or just blaze, and a tronic, which was the putty of this, of this uh, season. Wave two consisted of villain Roxy which is a great name for a villain, for those that are watching right now, you know I'm talking to you. And each of the, the buddy bots, beast bots, crews, smash, jacks, uh, which I don't have. All right, wave three consisted of silver beast morpher, red ranger, and red fury mode, where you get an added sword and claw weapons gold ranger the main villain evox and the monster of the day drillatron this was wave three and then wave four which this is the only figure i have so far this is blaze in his robot mode uh, other figures i think are in the same wave or same release is the beast x modes for Red Ranger, Blue Ranger, Yellow Ranger, and then the villain Vargoil. They haven't been released to stores just yet. You can pre order Big Bad Toy Store, I do believe. This is the one that was available so far on Amazon. The Rangers look good too. So I'm looking, I look at them. Can't help but think. Maybe they can use a little extra paint on them. Right here in this the zipper part maybe. The silver and, and here. I don't know. What do you think? Fury mode too. A shiny red paint on his shield. And on his cheetah claw. I even got the zipper underneath and the black straps. 
Here's the Gold Ranger 2. It looks better with the zipper going along. Got a little bit on silver, but it's kind of hard to tell because that silver paint on him is really shiny to begin with, but you can see a little bit and on his transporter. Oh yeah, there you go, you got, you got your Rangers. Let's take a look at some comparisons with other figures, not all figures. for the villains with some other villains each figure all the male characters can move their heads on a ball joint so they have good articulation with their heads move all the way around arms move all the way out or all the way out 360 the uh, elbow joint it doesn't swivel at the forearm but it swivels at the elbow so the elbow rotates that's a different mechanic there it's 90 degrees, no wrist, no waist. For the Rangers, each one of them can uh, do a split, kick all the way out. Can't kick, can't kick back unless you rotate the the leg, and then it's not kicking behind you anyways. Knee can bend. No thigh rotation, but the knee rotates around, just like the elbow. So that's that's weird. And no, and no uh, ankle movement. The Yellow Ranger can. It has the same articulation in the head arm, elbow, all the way around. She has a skirt. Can she pose out her legs? She can. She can kick straight out. Even with a skirt, can kick straight out. It's a nice flex material. Do the splits out like that. Even, even with a skirt, she can sit. So they did an excellent job on engineering the skirt for her. Power Rangers struggled at that. Now the villains, they can move their heads all the same. They can move straight out. They can kick out, kick straight out in front of them. But they can't, but they can't pose, pose out, they can't split. So that's unfortunate. I don't, I don't know why the villains are like that. Here's the very uh, marker I used for the chrome. I'll put a link in the description down below. Liquid chrome. It's chrome color. As nice, nicely painted as he is, I'm probably going to do the same thing to Lightning Collection Lord Zed.
key thing uh, that goes in the morpher. Fold just like that. And it can fold back out both directions. And can fit. On the arm, as a, on the arm of the figure, as a weapon. Here's the Red Rangers, Blue Rangers, Yellow Rangers. One for a Tronic. It's actually a different one for the Fury Mode Red Ranger. A little bit different. Silver Rangers. Gold Rangers, Blaze Robo Mode. It's this figure right here. The one for the Blaze Ranger. Right here. It's the one for the Roxy figure. Drilltrons. This guy right here. And this one's. Evoxes. Big boss right there. Right. Since I didn't show it here, here's the packaging for each of these figures. And then this one came from the Red Ranger. It has Red Ranger's face on it. There's the back of the box. Shows what's in the line. Figure. There's the Morpher. Have the morpher, and I'm really not planning on getting the morpher, but it shows you take the key, put it in the morpher, and then sounds come up additional sounds too. They all have different sounds that the morpher plays out plays and key boxes, boxes with them in it. New Robo Blaze, in case anyone cares. The Roxy figure. The reason why I'm saying the Roxy figure that way. Person watching those. Power Rangers Beast Morphers. Six inch basic figures. It's a nice set. And it's nice that they scale with the Lightning Collection so you don't have to, you know, spend the $20 on the same figure, even though they have additional, you know, weapons, better, better articulation, and you know, civilian heads, but you just want just the ranger ship suits and the monsters. These are a good option for half the price. That's, that's going to be it for the Power Rangers reviews for the next couple of videos. I think we'll take a break from that. Um, next, uh, I got a couple Batman figures I'm going to review. Um, they're a little bit different. You'll see in that video. Maybe a Transformers review in there. And then we'll head back to old vintage Power Rangers toys. So um, keep a look on that. And how do you stay tuned to all that? Well, make sure you make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell too. And you'll be up to date on whenever new videos are posted. Make sure you uh, comment down below. On what do you think about this video so we can make it, make this channel better make these videos better comment down below uh, links to anything I said like I said the liquid chrome marker linked descriptions down below follow us on Twitter Facebook and follow us on patreon and become a member for exclusive videos content and also check out our uh, our twitch gaming channel right over here link to that all these links are in the description down below as well and uh, that will wrap this up thank you for watching and have shablam kind of day